Hi, I'm Brandywine curator Amanda Burden. Since we're extending our holiday doll display, I thought it would take you back into our fine art collection in this staff pick to look at another original paper doll drawing. This work is by Marjorie Henderson Buell, who was best known by her pen name Marge, under which she drew the popular Little Lulu cartoons beginning in 1935. Buell grew up near Malvern and attended Chester County's Villa Maria Academy. This drawing was likely made between 1920 and 1930, but depicts fashions of an earlier era, probably the type of thing Buell's mother would have worn. No doubt she is poking fun at these fashions even as she carefully explains them in her handwritten captions. Let's take a look at this fashion show Buell presents in the form of a paper doll set. She titles the work, Just an Old Fashioned Paper Doll, Good Clean Fun for the Kitties. At the center, Daisy the debutante daintily sniffs a flower while showing off her decidedly hourglass figure. To the left is a red union suit with the caption, If caught in this costume, light a murad. Murad was a popular brand of Turkish cigarette in the early 20th century that was marketed to the college crowd even the women. Below that is a corset with garters wittily described as the very latest made of reinforced concrete for its dependable strength. To the right are two other undergarments, a slip with a frill and ribbon promoted as absolutely shadowproof, heavily padded with excelsior, which may have smoothed out a form, but would have also been highly flammable. Below that is the alternative to a corset, a pair of bloomers. Buell captioned this amorphous garment with the line, these snappy bloomers can be made at home in a jiffy out of three dozen flower sacks. Three dozen flower sacks is a lot of material. Three of the outfits are designed for sports and outdoor activity. At the far right, a full body bathing suit in green with pink trim is lampooned for its reserved nature. Buell writes, this bathing costume is perhaps a bit devilish, but oh my dear, how cool and comfortable. Below that, a clashing outfit of stripes, polka dots and plaids is explained as something new for wearing on the croquet court. No chance of being detected shoving the ball when wearing this skirt. Over to the left, a busy black and yellow striped turtleneck, perhaps to pair with the bloomers, is labeled a stunning jersey to wear when doing your dumbbell exercises. Finally, the most formal and elaborate of the outfits is sarcastically characterized as just a simple little frock and oh so practical, can be washed and ironed in no time at all, Wear the gown around the house and you'll never have to sweep the rugs.